Hey guys, this is the um, Uniserafi, which is a uh, new quadcopter from China, which is actually a quad clone from the Phantom Vision. And when I say clone, I mean clone. Apart from the fact that it's not um, supplied as default, uh, like the Phantom Vision 2 with a camera built in, you have to do that, all that bits, those bits and pieces yourself. But basically the rest of it is very close. If we take a look inside the box, we will see, let me get this lined up for you so you can get a good look. The manuals and stuff like that. I assume that's a landing gear. A very sort of, uh, how can I put this, interesting little controller. Battery, oops, I've got to get this in the right place, battery block. <laughs> um, propellers and the chargers under here. And the quad itself looks pretty good to start with I mean it's uh you can never tell of course until you have actually been running it for a while but uh whoa I gotta stop doing those weird movements but there it is the uni flight uh what is it called I can't even remember now uni flight seraphy or seraphi depending on how you pronounce it we'll get it together and uh get back to you so here's a Seraphi or Seraphi Phantom or Seraphi P, depending on what it's called. I'm just assembling the props and stuff to get it to fly in a second. So there's no switch on the uh, Seraphi, so you have to do a manual connect, unlike the Phantom, which has an elegant switch ready to go. So you just sort of plug it in. Um, very nice fat battery, I have to say. Here you go, 5600 milliamp hours, good enough, as they say, for 28 minutes flight time, which is pretty solid. It only just fits in there, mind you, with the squeeze, but it does go. Right, tuck the cables away, and then you have to do the uh, connect manually. Oops, like so. And you get the. There you go. And then tuck all the cables away. I can't do that one handed. I have to put the camera down again. Okay, so once the battery's connected, you've got the little green light tells you that it's uh, after a few minutes, tells you that the GPS is synced. Dump it down here. Oops, should be on level ground, of course. And then there's the good old controller. So rather like the um, Phantom, it's, it's in and down to the centers to get the thing started. Very sensitive controller. 